Hamilton County Commissioners have voted to accept a multi-million dollar bid for the construction of East Hamilton Middle School. Channel 3's Tim Pham was at the meeting and tells us when the ground will be broken. East Hamilton Middle School will be the first of two new schools to come from the tax increase in 2017, funding a $100 million facilities plan. This is the design for the new East Hamilton Middle School. Community members say it's much needed. About 1,700 students attend the current middle high school and they're running out of space. I think that it's very well designed. It appears to, that they've got a, a solid plan in place. The new facility will take about 800 students from the current space and house grades 6 through 8. County commissioners approved a $42 million bid from Tricon Incorporated to build the new school. This project is one on a long list of facility improvements across the district. Chairman Sabrina Smedley says District 7 and 9, where East Hamilton is located, is expected to grow by 32 percent over the next 10 years and schools are at capacity. More families means more people on the roads. Traffic is always a concern. It is always a, um, a bear in our area and um, definitely um, the traffic on East Brainerd Road is uh, a bit of a worry. Right now, parents say pick up and drop off traffic stretches onto main roads, but school officials say they have a solution aside from staggering school start times. We're going to put a new road in. Um, we're going to separate our car riders from our bus riders and we're going to circle the traffic around the middle school and exit uh, tie in to the exit at the Appison Elementary. The new facility will also feature four athletic fields. Commissioners praised the bid and project for staying under budget. Tricon Incorporated was the low bidder. They've built multiple schools for Hamilton County, including East Brainerd Elementary and Saudi Elementary School. District officials say they hope to break ground on the new school in late February or early March. We'll let you know when that happens. Reporting in Hamilton County, I'm Tim Pham, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.